Pete Farndon was a British musician who played bass guitar and sang backing vocals for the rock band The Pretenders. He was born on June 12, 1952 in Hereford, England, and grew up in a musical family. He learned to play guitar, piano, and harmonica at a young age. Farndon moved to London in the early 1970s and became involved in the pub rock scene. He played with various bands, including Cold River Lady, The Bushwickers, and Clancy. He also worked as a session musician for artists such as Peter Frampton, Dave Edmonds, and Nick Lowe. In 1978, he met guitarist James Honeyman Scott and drummer Martin Chambers, who were looking for a bassist to form a new band with singer Chrissy Hind. They auditioned Farndon and liked his style and personality. They named their band The Pretenders after a song by The Platters. The Pretenders quickly rose to fame with their debut single Stop Your Sobbing, a cover of a kink song, which reached the top 40 in the UK and the US in 1979. Their self-titled first album was released in 1980 and was a critical and commercial success. It featured hits such as Brass and Pocket, Kid and Tattooed Love Boys. Farndon's bass playing was an integral part of the band's sound, providing a solid foundation and melodic counterpoint to Heinz vocals and Honeyman Scott's guitar. He also contributed backing vocals and occasional lead vocals, such as on the song Mystery Achievement. The Pretenders' second album, Pretenders 2, was released in 1981 and continued their popularity. It included songs such as Talk of the Town, Message of Love, and I Go to Sleep. However, the band also faced personal and professional challenges. Farndon developed a heroin addiction that affected his performance and behavior. In 1982, he got fired from the band by Hind. Farndon tried to form a new band with former Clash drummer Topper Heaton, but the project never materialized. He also recorded some solo demos with producer Mick Glossop, but they were never released. On April 14, 1983, Farndon was found dead in his bathtub at his home in London. He had drowned after suffering a heroin-induced heart attack. He was 30 years old. Pete Farndon is remembered as one of the most talented and charismatic bassists of his generation. He was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame with the Pretenders in 2005. His legacy lives on through his music and his influence on other musicians.